In this video, we're going to give you information about the different types of RVs. The best way to know which RV has the amenities you want and need is to weigh the pros and cons of each RV type. While it's easy to choose an RV based on its physical features, the RV that will best suit your needs might not be the RV you're drawn to aesthetically. Class A Motorhomes Class A motorhomes are the biggest drivable RVs and are often associated with luxury and comfort. Their large bus frames are built on a truck chassis providing RV manufacturers with the flexibility to make heavier and more spacious RVs. Class A motorhomes come with two types of engines. The smaller, more lightweight models typically have a gas engine, while the larger and heavier models come with a diesel engine. Regardless of the engine, most classes have amenities like residential appliances, upgraded flooring and furniture, and ample underbelly storage. Because Class A RVs can handle more weight, the freshwater, black, and gray tanks are almost always bigger than those installed on smaller RVs. Class B Motorhomes Class B Motorhomes, made popular by the van life movement, are the smallest drivable RVs on the market. Class Bs, also called campervans, come with two types of engines, gas and diesel. Class B RVs are nimble enough to fit in standard parking spaces yet big enough to have small kitchens, a flexible living and sleeping area, and sometimes even toilets and showers. Class B RVs are different from conversion vans, cargo vans customized into living spaces by a third party. Class C Motorhome Class C Motorhomes are the most rented type of RV on the road. Class C's are built on a van chassis with a living space constructed around the cab. Class C RVs are versatile and easy to drive. The gas-powered engines are strong enough to withstand a heavy load yet still perform well on inclines and hills. Most Class C RVs have a bedroom, bathroom with a shower, a kitchen, and a convertible dinette sleeping area. Usually, the signature cab over bed serves as a secondary sleeping space, even though some people use that location for extra storage. While Class C might look compact from the outside, these small motorhomes transform into comfortable living spaces when parked at the campground, especially the Class C's that come with one or more slide-outs. Super C's An exception is the category of Class C motorhomes are Super C's. This is the term for a Class C style construction, but instead of using a passenger van as a base, a large heavy-duty diesel truck is used as a base. Super C's are popular with those that need to tow a lot of weight. These are frequently used to tow heavy trailers with race cars in them or heavy horse trailers. Super C's can be very luxurious inside and very expensive, but they can tow 10,000 to 40,000 pounds. Van conversions and camper vans. Van conversions and camper vans can blur the lines with Class B motorhomes. For our purposes, we will classify van conversions as vans that were sold fully assembled as cargo or passenger vans and then were converted by the user or a professional to provide living space for camping. Van conversions can run from very simple DIY options to high-end conversions. Typically, van conversions will be smaller than Class B's and may have fewer amenities. Many may forego the inclusion of a bathroom in order to keep the van smaller and maximize the functionality of the interior space. Because van conversions and camper vans are smaller, they drive much like the original van so they can be very easy to handle day to day. Often van conversions do not look like RVs so it is easy to park them on city streets and not stand out. Fifth Wheel Fifth Wheel Travel Trailers are the biggest towable RVs and one of the most popular types of RVs for full-time living. A fifth wheel hitch is different from a bumper pull because a fifth wheel connects a pin box from the front of the trailer to a U-shaped coupling mounted in a truck bed. The truck bed connection helps to make fifth wheels ride smoother and more stable than a travel trailer, even though fifth wheels are almost always longer and heavier. Fifth wheels often have two levels with the upstairs level, the section that protrudes over the truck bed, housing the main bedroom or a bunkhouse multi-purpose area. Amenities like multiple slide-outs, an outdoor kitchen, extendable patio, reclining chairs, office space, and a kitchen island help make fifth wheels some of the most comfortable and luxurious trailers on the road. Toy haulers. Almost all toy haulers are either travel trailers or fifth wheels, but toy haulers are an RV type all their own because of their garages. Toy haulers have living areas and a multi-purpose utility space designed to carry motorcycles, off-road utility vehicles, kayaks, dirt bikes, or other toys inside of the RV. Some toy haulers have a designated garage space to keep the toys separate from the living quarters, while smaller toy haulers may have to share their living area with the toy during transit. Travel trailers. Travel trailers are the most popular RVs on the market because they are versatile and come in many different lengths and weights. Travel trailers have hard sides and typically have a kitchen, a sleeping area, a bathroom, and a convertible dinette or living room that functions as a secondary sleeping space. 
Larger travel trailers may have slide outs and separate living and sleeping quarters and amenities like a bunkhouse or outdoor kitchen. The average size of a travel trailer ranges between 20 to 30 feet long and can stretch to 40 feet in length. Smaller travel trailers are also popular, giving tiny trailers a category of their own. To tow a travel trailer, you must have a tow vehicle with a sufficient tow rating and a hitch installed to connect the trailer. Pop-up campers Pop-up campers look and function like hybrid RV tents. Depending on the model, the trailer frame typically has a hard-sided bottom section that houses the kitchen, dinette, storage, toilet, or shower, when available. When the camper is in driving mode, the tent section of the trailer collapses into the hard-sided bottom. When the pop-up camper is in camping mode, the tent section of the trailer extends to provide more headroom, sleeping space, and zippable sides and windows. People often choose pop-up campers because the streamlined profile is lightweight and easy to tow, and they cost less than most travel trailers. Tiny Travel Trailers Tiny travel trailers, sometimes called micro-trailers, share similar features to traditional travel trailers, but they deserve their own category because of their small and flexible living spaces. Tiny travel trailers include teardrop, fiberglass, clamshell, and some smaller pop-ups. Some tiny travel trailers come self-contained with indoor kitchens and wet baths, while others have outdoor kitchens and a flexible living sleeping area. Tiny travel trailers are popular because they are lightweight and smaller SUVs and trucks can tow them. Truck campers. Truck campers sit in the bed of a pickup truck, and because of weight, they almost always require a one-ton or a dually, dual rear wheel, truck. Most truck campers have hard sides, a bed, a kitchen, and a toilet or a wet bath. Lighter weight truck campers may have a compact pop-up roof, while the heavier truck campers are tall enough for people to stand. Some of the more luxurious truck campers have slide outs, helping them feel a little bigger inside. To summarize, there are many types of RVs available today. Knowing the main differences between them will help you choose the right RV for your family. Ready to learn more? Check out our channel where we make sense of some of the RV terms you might have heard thrown around by others. Moisture is a common problem in RVs. Moisture can result from breathing by the inhabitants as well as water vapor from cooking or drying of clothes. Rainwater entering the RV can also be a cause. In addition, moisture will often condense on windows since they are usually the coldest surfaces inside the vehicle. Learning about each RV type makes it easier to determine whether a drivable or towable RV or a truck camper will best suit your traveling needs. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.